welcome to the channel. There's a lot going on with Karlov Manor right now, the uh, Capenna Manor. And uh, right now, the boxes have dipped into, I think, $180.99 on eBay um, shipped. So I, things are a disaster. I priced out that first box opening I did. And uh, I think the price of the cards inside before fees was right around $200 for every single card included. Um, which that's not good. That's really bad, especially on opening, you know, weekend because then typically prices crash. So the interesting thing will be will prices go the opposite way. But I can say I, I wanted to show you guys some stuff because as I was looking through these and the, uh, the foiling is actually really good. And there's a couple of different um, cloaks and colors and things like that. They put time into this. And then on the back of some of these uh, um, clue tokens, there's things that you can put together for part of, I mean, so clearly my point is they put time into the set. And I ended up buying three more because 180 is just too good. The deal is too good. So I bought three more boxes. We're gonna open it up, see what happens. If I break even, I break even. You guys get to see a box opening, but I don't know. I mean, the things might recover because uh, usually things crash, and maybe because everybody is in such poor spirits, it crashes and you know ahead of time, and then it ends up recovering. So I don't know. We're gonna do two today. How about that? Two today, and uh, maybe three next week or the following week. Let's see if I can get it to come out. Man, they are really tight in there. So. And we're off. There we go. Okay, we got a clue. And you see, this is the, this, I think this is one of the ones I was missing uh, from my last one, oddly enough. Ooh, right off the bat. Vein Ripper. Um... Invisible ink, so you can see there's uh, numbers there, and you can see a body. So we're gonna go ahead and sleeve up the invisible ink. Those things are the really the the gem of the set, which right now they're between twenty and you know thirty-five dollars, depending on which one you get. Um, so not tons of value, but there's just so few of them. That, like, will it end up being more? I don't know. Lost in is that a dinosaur? Skeleton Beast. Lost in the Maze. Okay, demanding answers. And there's also a couple, you know, commons, uncommons that are worth something. You know. A couple bucks, which which always helps. Kind of reminds me of the values, honestly, of uh, Wilds of Eldraine. Wilds of Eldraine, um, really the, the valuable stuff was the anime. And, um... It had some one and two dollar commons, and all the rares were worthless. Spirit of Justice, Spirit Detective. Yeah, it seems like a pretty good card. Uh, okay, did I put a foil? No, I didn't. Center of the web. Okay. Oh, look at that art there. The Rage Mother. That's the commander. Oh, another ley line. Got this last video. It's around ten bucks right now. Keep chases on murder planes. So this is one of the ones where I think this has a different color, and you can kind of see see that shimmer on it. It's just very slight. That's one of the ones though that I believe is is different. I haven't seen multiple versions of it. It's just. Um, when I think. Um, okay, actually we didn't have that clue as well. So, the different boxes must have different clues. Ferox, Death Touch Haste, okay. Um, the Thrall, Flash Flying, Artifact Reading, uh, Trigger. Don't cause abilities to trigger, okay. On the trail, each player controls only. Okay, we have hold that one, Cryptex. Snuffler. Ambusher, Mountain, Shock. Okay. 
One two dollar commons and uncommons are always a nice p perk. You know, it just kind of helps uh, Thunder and Falls. This one is doing pretty good. Oh, two lands back to back. Take the bait. Back from the dots. Arca three land pack. The lands are around seven bucks or so right now. Unauthorized exit. But there's really not a lot of high dollar stuff here, that's for sure. So unless things change. Okay, King Midas. What we got? Delaney. It's our first uh, Delney, sorry. Our first uh, Delney pull. Very good. Feels pretty crazy. Oh! That's a good pack, let me tell you. Uh, that's how you get your money back in a pack. <laughs> Holy cow. And this is a really, in my opinion, a really good card. Uh, I think it's around like nine bucks right now. Um, the time I do the um, the values on the cards will be different from the values I'm telling you. So if they don't be like, oh, he's wrong. Okay, binding. So, I mean, the foiling. They actually did a better job than normal on the foiling. And I was thinking about that last night. I was like, you know. It's not that bad. This is one of the ones that's like two bucks. Um, it's not that bad. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, was it really Capenna art that they had left over, or are they trying to like shift, you know, that Capenna scene and and plane into into something else that's a little more, you know, palatable? Kellen. Okay. I don't know how Kellen's doing. I, I have zero clues. Rookie. The eye pulled one of those already. Uh, Phoenix, that's not doing too well. Uh -huh. Lightning Helix, right. you've seen that before, huh? We've seen that before. Detective Dog, Performer, Hedge Maze. Little note. I haven't seen a serialized card get pulled out of here, so I think it's pretty hard to do. Relive the past, which thank God, because to be honest, it was a little bit inflated in the last set. Ooh, a dragon. You have combat the angel player, you may collect evidence when you do, deals damage, you know, playing the locker, player controls. Interesting. I don't... Uh, I haven't really played much in this set. I don't really know the mechanic well enough to to know if that's going to fit well with other things. Insidious Roots. Orb. Oh. <laughs> Close call. Oh, we got another clue. Analyze the pollen. Okay, yeah, we've had this clue before. Analyze the pollen. Seems okay. Underground, okay. My one friend was telling me that one's gonna be worth a little bit more. Blood spatter. Roots. It seems like this one also is gonna be like pretty decent. Kellen again. All the bodies. Trophy. Tenth District Hero. Bandit. Okay. Not a clue. We got this one. Ooh, elegant parlor. Very nice. Yeah, I don't. I think I have that one already. I don't know. Parlor looks great. Gadgeteer. Robbery. Search. Deduce. Little 
forest. As you can see, invisible ink cards are hard to pull. What do we got here? Crocodile, <laughs> man bear pig. Crocodile, elk turtle. <laughs> this is literally man bear pig. This spell costs an ankle and a defender. Uh, 215. Oh, yeah. Seems pretty decent, actually. Well, next last to cast. Total toughness. Okay, so you, if you have really tough creatures, you get one really tough creature. Uh, Chief. Theorist. Hero. I saw him already. Scholar. What a weird detective that is. Interrogators. Escape good. What a weird... Man, that is. I am not selling any of the invisible ink cards that I pull. Reason being, again, I just feel like they're too low. You only get one per box. Now let's try to do it this way. Okay. Light. Hot pursuit. Okay. Yeah, I really hate pull tabs. Did I ever mention that? Detective. Ooh. Okay, so you can see. There we go. Look, there's the maze. There ha that has to be a clue, that maze, right? It's solvable. Yeah, it has to be. Spirit Sphinx Detective. Where of faces. Yeah, I mean, nice looking card. There's the sleuth again. Backstreet. Okay. And these land, uh, the art looks good. It looks, it doesn't, it's not that bad. Man bear pig. Trouble comes in pairs. Felix again. Detective? Oh. Yeah, pulled him in the first box. Elf Ooze Wizard. Okay. There's the urgent again. Suspicious arrival. We got the inventor, an artificer, a menace ward haste. Backstreet, okay. Yeah, the detective, he's foil this time. Sharp eyed rookie, deduce. Thundering Falls foil. I mean, I'll take some foil lands. That's, that's fine. Okay, Judith. We got Judith again. Blood Splatter. Okay. Oh, that's a new one, I think. Farmer, Rampage. 
Lost in the maze. Enigma, coerced. I feel like that orb is one that changes colors. I, I don't know, maybe I'm, maybe I'm looking for something that's not there. Yeah, 180 for this, I feel like it's still a pretty good deal. It's under distributor prices. Okay. Bolt Strider. Make another Kellen. Ransom note. Underground. Okay. Unauthorized exit. Remember, check me out on TCG Player, but use my link in the description to go to my pro sites. I don't have to pay those fees. Save me from the fees. Relive the past. Investigator. Escort. Doppelgang. Okay. Masquerade. Well, Loxodon in this set. Oddly enough. I mean, yeah, I guess it's Ravnica based. Ooh. Special guest. Fabricate. Looking good. That's a special guest card. Very nice. Put that there. Sewers. Okay. Today, the special guest is Fabricate. Analyze the pollen again. Okay. Yaris. Deep operative. Case, the chase. Okay, one pack left. Can we do it? Let's pull that serialized card from King Midas. Clue? Ooh, we do have a... Do you have another Rakdos? Invisible ink card to pull. I pulled him in the first video. So now I got two. I'll take one out in case it gets scratched. There's something like 35 right now. Niv. I mean, I, I wouldn't mind just hanging on to a Niv. Just a, just a habit. Oh, Makeshift binding. Okay. Murder. Island. I don't know where the serialized card is, so very possible I missed it. Oh, see, you can see the foiling on that looks really good. Hot shot investigators. Yeah, thanks for checking out the channel. Thanks for watching. Let me know your thoughts on the on the Capenna Manor here, and um, let me know your thoughts on serial or not the invisible ink cards. And do you think that the values are going to go up because there's so few of them? Um, do you think that the cards aren't that good, so nobody's going to care <laughs> whether or not they? Uh, are invisible ink or not so I don't know let me know thanks again everyone we'll talk to you later